convert a QWERTY keyboard into a Dvorak standard layout you'll need a container to put the keys in a screwdriver to pop the keys out I'm going to start with the left side and just work my way I'm going to push the ALT key down insert the screwdriver gently in here gently let it come down as you can see it pops right off um, <coughs> nothing was broken as you can tell this is the letter Z and the back side this part actually snaps inside of this casing I'm going to do that with the rest of them As you can tell, you can go through the keys fairly quickly. One of the things you may be surprised to see so I'm is down what's to under the last keys. four keys. And um, uh, just a note: if you come to an I, you think it might be a minus sign, or vice versa. Um, just double check on that. If there's a key that doesn't quite look like it belongs on this layout. It probably does, and it might not be upside right. Um, so I've got four keys here, U, F, J, and H on this particular micro keyboard, which, um, well, they don't exactly fit. The, uh, the problem here lies in this extra little um, piece. Uh, I think it's just to support the key as these um, two on the index fingers are supposed to be the ones that are used the most with the strongest fingers. Um, so what I'm going to have to do is, um, well, break it. <laughs> I'm going to have to take this off, otherwise um, obviously it's not going to um, go in here. And, uh, and it's likewise in here there's another piece up on the top, I'm going to have to break that so that these keys See, will slide in. To remove the guide, the guide from this key and if this doesn't work I'll be out of keyboard but it looks like it's coming off quite easily I'm just twisting it that way I'm not putting any pressure on the actual column and it comes right off I'm going to do the same thing with the other um, index key which would be uh, J So again, the same thing. I'm just going to grab it with uh, needle nose pliers and twist either way, righty tighty, lefty loosey. Should come off pretty easy. Eventually, there will be nothing left to twist off, and you should have a pretty clean edge here, which that's what it's that's what it feels like. So obviously, I can use sandpaper if there's anything left that gets in the way of this keyboard going uh, um, going down pressing pressing down so now the, the problem with these two keys are that they've got little pieces in here so I'm going to take those off uh, in just a moment the micro keyboard converted to Dvorak la uh, layout standard form um, there being a difference that there is in fact a, a right handed and a left handed form, which I can only imply to be focusing on making it easier for one of your hands uh, especially. So um, the last thing you would need to do if you're interested in it was removing the um, little bumps from the J and the F and putting bumps or um, maybe drilling a, a screw um, to serve as a guides for your index fingers on you and H.